Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today it's going to be a little bit different. I am with Jose. What's up guys? And we are at the Disney Music Resort down in Orlando, Florida. And we're going to go down to the diner and try some Disney Resort delicacies and we're going to bring you along. Let's go. Each place has its own thing. So this is the bakery. And it has cookies, brownies, and more cookies. We got this. And then they have donuts and bagels. guys so we're gonna go ahead and go into this line I haven't done a dry shrimp and grits never had it so they have it here so I'm gonna go up in here and get some shrimp and grits Who's, who does such a thing? <laughs> well, I keep recording it, and I'm just gonna end up editing it out anyway because it's like boring. What's boring? <laughs> we, we, we make it exciting and we're yeah? entertaining. Oh, I see it. Hit me with a little dance. Hit me with a little dance. <laughs> <laughs> see, entertainment. Yeah. That's entertainment quality right there. Yes. I brought my sweater because it was like raining and cold. And now I just have to like carry it around, which is like an inconvenience and it's very annoying. She's always cold, guys. I am. So while we're waiting, because it's going to take about seven minutes, let's go to the marketplace and see what they have in the marketplace. Let's go. This is for the little snacks you take to oh, your room. Cute. It's a Rice crispy Mickey Mouse. Five dollars for a Rice crispy Treats. You remember these back in high school, my old friends, like, you know, old friends like me as, you know, back in the 90s kids? These that were in school. Do you want to know what they have today? They drink out of a bag. Tell me if your kids go to school and drink out of a bag, because that's what my kids drink out of, was a bag. I like, love it. Like, you can, look at this. Now, they're $4.19. You can buy a whole bag for about $3, but you get three of them. <laughs> Oh my god, $10 for a great salad. Jason. So you got a kid's turkey sandwich, $7.79. Now, you know, kids love these peanut butter jelly. You could buy these at Walmart for like, you know, five bucks or ten bucks. You get a whole bunch of them. It brings twelve in a box. For a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, they are $4.79. And for a kid's meal, which you probably get the apple slices, is $6.79. Like that's ridiculous, guys. That's ridiculous. Five dollars for that. Five dollars. That's crazy. Like, are you insane? I don't think you're gonna get drunk because you know that's a lot of money for one. So for twenty one ninety nine, you get this and you get free refills. Which, if you're staying for a few days, is a great deal. You can come in here whenever you want, and fill it up. It's not very big though, but it's twenty one dollars, and you get to take it home. Your entire stay. <laughs> looks like soup, actually. This looks really good. <laughs> Alright, now we're going to go check out. So for all of this, two drinks, 
38.12, which isn't really bad because I could have went to Burger King or any fast food joint and it's about the same price. Now you get fries, but I got dessert. So we're gonna see how it tastes and I'm gonna let you guys know. All right, so I'm a pepper saw girl. So we're gonna add some pepper. Now I have to say the shrimp look a lot different. It has ham in it. It almost looks like, like potato soup with shrimp in it. So I'm curious to see what it's gonna taste like. The only downfall is I've never had shrimp and grits. So I don't even know what it's supposed to taste like, but let's see. I don't know. Definitely, I guess we'll just do a bite with some grits in there and some ham and, and let's see what it tastes like. It's actually really good. The ham, a lot ham flavor in it. The grits are good. Um, grits are a little mushy actually, which grits are not supposed to be as mushy. But overall, it tastes good. It's not horrible. And he said I wouldn't eat it, and I will eat it. <laughs> I think she's only doing it because I said that, guys. No, you want to try? Here. Now let's see. Let's you try. Tell me what you think. It's good. Yeah, I it's would eat that. Very ham based. So I got a Coke. I love to eat some Coke. But I hate me some paper straws. Like, I know it's good for the environment, but I'm gonna be honest with you, it makes the Coke not taste good. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's a mind thing, but it's huh. like full of paper rolls. It's just so awkward. Like, man, I miss them plastic straws. <laughs> All right, so how was your food? What did you think? Okay, first off, I want to say that the, the rice tasted good, but the chicken, the chicken is cool. It's not warm. It's kind of hard on the outside. It's very hard on the outside that it has like crunch to it. I don't believe that sesame seed chicken is supposed to be hard where it has a crunch, but it is. And I'm not a very big fan of it. And it, you know, it's supposed to be one of those Disney quality meals where it's supposed to be really good. And I'm thinking it would be better than the theme park because it's a resort where people are going to come and stay for a few days and, you know, eat their food. But if this is the quality of their food, I'm gonna have to give it two stars out of five. Two stars out of five for the sesame seed chicken meal. It has, you know, broccoli and some vegetables in it, but I did not enjoy it, not at all. I would rather go to a regular Chinese store and get this than ever eat this again. Uh, not good. So mine was pretty good. And I think it's because it was fresh. His, I don't think was fresh. So it's probably was sitting there and that's why the chicken's hard and it's not fresh. So they just made mine. Um, Cause you can't let, you know, grits and stuff sit there. Lola, sit there. <laughs> <laughs> But um, it was good, it has ham in it, it's got green peppers in it, it's a little spicy. Uh, but overall, I give it like a five. I don't think it was horrible or something I would order again. Definitely want to try some different shrimp and grits because I've never seen this before. So maybe this is just something that Disney Resort made. But we're going to go ahead and jump into the best part, which is this uh, little dessert here. I'm not sure exactly, he's saying this is marshmallow. I believe that's marshmallow, guys. That's a lot of marshmallow. I'm assuming this is a little chocolate ear, you know, Mickey's ear. So I don't even know how to eat this thing, but let's try. I believe that she should just pick it up and bite it. What do you guys think? Uh, nah, nah. I will have, I already touched it. Like, look, it's like very, whatever this is. Yes, so. we got to make it entertaining for the people. Let's see. I don't think that's marshmallow. Where is it? I don't know. It almost looks like a cream cheese. Maybe it a looks like a cheesecake type of thing. Cream cheese brownie. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Ooh, look at that face though. Mm. Very, woo. very cheesy. Mm -hmm. Very rich. Uh, it's good. A lot of cream cheese. He will love this. Like when I get cream cheese from the store, I get like the little tiny one. It's he gets, wait, like, wait, the wait, the wait, one. wait, wait. It's not cream cheese, love. It's cheesecake. cheesecake. Melissa, cheesecake. Melissa is not a fan of thick cheesecakes. Yes. She likes the smaller pieces. She doesn't like them too thick. You have to sink your, of, yeah, it's too much. Too much cheesecake, but it's really good though. Um, if you like, love cheesecake, this would be for you. I want to say this is a brownie at the bottom. Let me, I couldn't tell what it was because the cheesecake is so overpowering. You can't even taste anything else but cheesecake. It's just a cake. Frosting is not bad. Not a lot of frosting, which I like because I'm not a fan What's of What's the red stuff? I don't know. It's... I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't even taste like anything. So I want you to try it because I think you it. How about what by them ears? Oh, poor Mickey. Just How's chocolate. that Disney chocolate? Eh, could be richer. Richer, you know, Disney's rich. <laughs> it's not bad, but I never thought that was cheesecake. That's crazy. I wonder how much this was. This cheesecake is a very expensive meal. meal. Dessert. I got lost the receipt, you know. I think I crumbled it up. Let's see. 
I can't really say that's bad. Because you can go to the Cheesecake Factory, and, you know, you're going to be... If you look at it, that's bad. a lot That's a lot of cheesecake. You know, if you look at it, you know, that's a, a very big piece of cheese on top of that. Yes, it is. It's a lot. He got a donut. Like, a glazed donut. <laughs> so, I mean... Gotta keep it simple. Let's see if the donut tastes like a donut or a glazed donut. You know, because he's a... What would you call it? I'm a, a glazed donut connoisseur. There you go. So, he should know. Single donut. See, again, I'm gonna be the bearer of bad news for Disney World and its resorts. This donut tastes cheap. It tastes like a donut that you'll get from the grocery store and not at the bakery, like out of one of those donut boxes. This is what it tastes like. It tastes like one of those donut boxes donuts. It doesn't taste fresh. Like this is not like a fresh from the bakery donut. If you can see, this is not it looks like- It dry and it shouldn't be all the way. It doesn't look like a donut. Yeah. Like a bakery donut. Like we could go to Publix and go to the bakery and their fresh donut do not look like this. He's just not doing good today. Got some bad chicken. Taste some it. Bad tell me donut. what you doing. Tell me if it, that doesn't you taste gotta try like- my cheesecake. Tell me first. that doesn't taste like, you know, like a donut from like a box. One of those hostess donuts. Try my cheesecake first. Yes. That's that's nice. Again, you would have to be someone that likes cheesecake a lot because when you sink the fork in, it going, it's going pretty deep and you're getting a lot. I like cheesecake. I'm a cheesecake guy. Like I like the thick cheesecake pieces. Very, like she said, it's very rich to them. Like it's a very rich cheesecake flavor. Not, you know, not very sweet. Kind of like a, I don't know how to explain it. Like a, uh, what's, what would be the word? Kind of like a, it's got like a little tang to it, you know? Yeah, I can see that. Let me try this donut. All right, it's, it's cold too. Well, glazed donuts are better at room temperature to me. It doesn't taste like a glazed donut. No, it doesn't. It tastes like a, what is that donut? I don't even know what that donut's called. It tastes like one of those hostess donuts, the donuts that come in the box, like in the- It reminds me of, a, I'm gonna sorry, like I know people probably like Dunkin' Donuts, but I'm not a fan of Dunkin' Donuts, especially their donut. The coffee's good, but I'm a type of, I like a soft donut um, where you bite into it, it's just like, wow, like melt in your mouth, kind of Krispy Kreme type of donut. Publix has pretty good donuts. Um, what's the other place? Walmart. Walmart does too sometimes. Walmart. You go to Walmart when they're just baked that day, oh my gosh, they're to die for. But this is something that's like you said, the, it's, the bread's hard. It's not like a nice soft donut. So yeah, I give this about a one cheesecake. I give a five. Even though I'm not huge on cheesecake, it was still really good. I gotta say, overall for my meal, it was amazing. Um, tomorrow we're gonna come in for breakfast and we're gonna see how their breakfast is here. So make sure you stay tuned for that as well. I don't know. She says her meal was amazing, but there's still quite a bit of meal in there. There's a, there's a lot of bit, you know. She didn't take a lot of out of that. So you got anything to say about that? Yes, yeah, so I have a little tiny stomach. <laughs> <laughs> like it was good, but I can't eat no more. Like I might try to take it with me, but I don't know if there was there a microwave in there. I don't believe so. No, I don't think there was. So I'll eat this last shrimp because shrimp is a delicacy. I love it, but you know, nope, that's it. So we'll see you tomorrow early in the morning, hopefully. I am not a morning person, but I want to check out their breakfast and see how their breakfast is here at the resort and that is still allowed. So give me one second. So we'll see you tomorrow morning at around 10 a.m. for breakfast and we're gonna see how that goes. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Mind okay. you guys, mind you guys, she might be a little cranky. She might be a little cranky in the morning, so <laughs> don't 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 judge her. Give her a break. Yeah. So we'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Have a good night. All right guys, so we were supposed to go to breakfast this morning. I know I told you guys that, but well, I decided to sleep a little bit longer. You know, I'm not much of a breakfast person. I'm more of a brunch person because I'm not a morning person. Um, so we didn't get to show you that, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. That's gonna be the end of this video. So if you liked it, give it a like, share it. If you wanna see what this hotel looked like, please subscribe to Jose's channel. It's down in this description and the little bottom down here I'll also leave a little link here to his channel so it should pop up right here you can check out his channel as well so see to see what the hotel looked like and don't forget to share this video out subscribe and until next time guys we'll see ya